So welcome back to the channel and in today's video we're going to do some film photography. I just got the urge to do uh, a bit of film so I picked up this Harman black and white camera, disposable camera and we're going to get out and uh, shoot some images and uh, send them off for development see what they come out like. So it's pretty much a crap shoot with this camera, I'm not really sure what I'm going to get out of it. There's a fixed lens, a little plastic lens, uh, 400 film, it's a bit of an overcast day so that should be alright. But um, generally, apart from being, having to be a metre away from your subject, I'm not really sure what's going to come out and what isn't. So um, that's going to be half the fun with a project like this. So what do I think of the little Harman disposable camera? It's filled with Ilford colour process black and white film, which is quite uh, handy, it means you can process it anywhere. It does cost $14.99 and for that $14.99 you're going to get 27 frames and it's going to cost you to process it as well. But I think if you just want to dabble in a little bit of black and white photography uh, a little bit of film photography for a change from digital then these little cameras are quite good you could of course buy a cheap point and shoot on the likes of ebay uh, used for um, less and just buy your own 35mm film but um, at least you know this is going to work straight out of the box and if it doesn't you can go and complain about it and um, get a replacement so I'm going to crack on, take some more photographs and uh, see get this film finished today, get it off to processing and uh, see what the results are like. So that's the last of our shots with our little camera. I uh, did think that I probably shot the last two or three uh, thinking it was almost done. It kept on taking photos until um, it finally stopped winding on and uh, then I knew the game was up which was a bit annoying because I think I took about two or three of the same shot at the end thinking it wasn't doing anything. Never mind, we shall uh, say what the images come out like and if I haven't shown you them already then I shall put them on screen now. So I've enjoyed taking this little camera out, it's been a little bit frustrating at times because the viewfinder is quite small 
and you're not really sure what the parallax is going to be between the viewfinder and the actual lens so thank you very much for watching this little video with this little camera it was just an impromptu video i just decided to um go and buy one of these little cameras and see what i could do and uh I thought I would do a little vlog alongside it and show you the uh, the images. So thank you very much for watching and if you like more film content like this then please do give it a thumbs up and leave comments below and um, I'm sure to do some more in the future.